now to the war in Ukraine. Russia unleashed a wave of more than 80 missiles across the country today, including several of its powerful hypersonic missiles. At least 11 people were killed in the attacks and hundreds of thousands were left without heat or electricity. More now from CBS's MTS Tayeb inside Ukraine. In Ukraine's far western Lviv region, the grim task of collecting the dead. Most here had largely been spared from Russia's ruthless attacks until now. This is the first time I witnessed such a tragedy, Vassil says. Russia is a devil. The barrage of strikes targeted 10 regions and included the use of at least six of the Kremlin's hypersonic anti-defense Kinjal missiles. Homes in the town of Kostyantinivka were leveled once again. Every day there's shelling, Olga says. I go to bed and don't know if I'll wake up. In her song, even a bus stop wasn't spared. More dead scattered in the street. A grim reminder the most mundane of acts can be deadly. All Ukrainians are targets in Russia's merciless assaults. These mourners in Zaporizhia attend the funerals of Kamila and Ilya, a 23-year-old couple killed last week in an earlier missile attack. Their seven-month-old daughter, Emilia, was also killed. Two generations now wiped out. It was a bloody day across this country, but Ukrainians continue to persevere, knowing all too well, more strikes will come. James. MTS, thank you.